Ah, uh, finally. I thought that taxi driver was going to cart us around half of California before dropping us off at the hotel. Man, I am spent. Why is flying so exhausting when all you really do is just sit around the whole time? I swear, the moment we get to our room, I will just drop dead on the bed. Huh? Yeah. Our room. Oh, excellent. There's no one else in front of us at the front desk. Um, hi. Uh, good evening. We, um, have a reservation. Or... Yep, that's us. Mm-hmm. Thank you very much. Man, finery. Gosh, I just cannot wait to get to our room. Huh? Yeah, just one key card. Why? Yeah? I only booked one room? We're traveling on a budget, remember? Oh, don't give me that. For how long have we known each other now? We've been working on this startup since we finished college. Now come on. Oh wait, you don't need to help me with my suitcase. It's awfully nice of you, but I am a big, strong, independent person, and I... <clears throat> okay. Maybe a little bit of help would be much appreciated. Oh, thank you. Wait, 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 wait. It's not that far. Let's see. 101. 102. Aha! Found it. 103. That's us. Here, let me open the door. Oh! Hey! This looks pretty nice. Thanks again for helping me with my suitcase. So, what do you think? Hey, what is it? You look a bit disheartened. I thought this room looked rather nice. I mean... As nice as hotel rooms can get with their generic art prints on the wall and their kind of anonymous atmosphere and all, but... Huh? Yeah. Now that you mention it, there is only one bed in this room. Which is weird. Because I could have sworn I booked a two-bedroom. Well, it'll be fine. We can make it work. And we're only gonna be here for a couple of nights anyway. Is it okay if I use the shower first? I'm feeling a little... Um... Try and think of a word that won't make this sound absolutely disgusting. Really? Doesn't matter. Anyway, point is, I've been wearing these clothes for way too long, so if it's okay, I'll just... Okay, great. Thank you. Ah, uh, this feels so amazing. This is just what I needed. 
I really don't know who invented the shower, but the man should have a Nobel Prize. I mean, who really needs the theory of relativity, really? Or the moon landing, or whatever else. The shower has had a much bigger impact on the betterment of mankind, if you're asking me. That was so incredible. Hey, have you already unpacked your stuff? Dude, stop it. You're making me look like a slob. Go on, hop in so that I can get dressed while you're under the shower. Oh. And what are you looking so red for? Really now? You look like a boiled lobster. Come on. You seen me in a bikini last summer. You should be able to handle seeing me wrapped up in a bath towel. Come on now. Chop chop. Go get in the shower. I want to towel myself off and get dressed and you're just standing here. Oh, uh, one more thing. They kind of only had one towel in the bathroom. So I guess we're going to have to share this one. It's still moderately dry, so I think it'll be fine. Maybe. Either way, I'm gonna come in and put it on the towel rack, okay? Don't worry, I won't look. Oh, you're done. Excellent. I guess I should go to the bathroom now so you can get dressed, huh? Mm. But I'm so comfy right now. I don't want to get up really. Is it okay if I simply promise not to peek? I can barely keep my eyes open anyway. Hey. What is it? Are you alright? Yeah, this is all I'm gonna wear for the night. Why? I always dress lightly when I sleep. What do you mean? Do you expect me to put a business suit on to catch some Z's? And why are you blushing again? No, I'm not peeking. I can just hear you blush. Yes, I can. Hey, what's taking you so long? Are you dressed yet? Can I open my eyes again? Hey, what's wrong? You look kind of dejected. What is it? Worried because of our presentation tomorrow? Come on now, we've been through this like a million times. We could probably do it in our sleep at this point. We're gonna blow their minds right out the back of their skulls. No? That's not it? Then what is it? Yeah? There's no couch in this room. It's a really small hotel room for sure. I should have probably gotten more suspicious because it was so cheap, huh? Sorry. 
Why would you ask for room service for an extra bed sheet? What? No! You're not sleeping on the floor. Are you crazy? I know San Francisco is warm this time of the year, but... For real now, what's gotten into you all of a sudden? Huh? No! You're not sleeping in that chair either. Seriously, I'm getting back pain from merely looking at that thing. I need you in peak form for the conference tomorrow. A good first impression is half the battle here. Do you think anyone is going to buy into our startup if you shuffle around like a zombie with bags under your eyes and twisted from an aching spine? Sorry? <laughs> oh, that face of yours. Don't worry. I don't bite. I don't snore. I don't thrash wildly out in my sleep. And I won't turn into a werewolf at full moon and devour you either. You have absolutely nothing to worry about. No need to be so bloody awkward. <sighs> For real now, you can either get in here with me or you can keep pondering your options. Newsflash, there are none. And you just get in here with me in a half an hour anyway. All you're going to accomplish is depriving yourself of half an hour of sleep. You know we have to rise early tomorrow, right? So come on. Stop being so bloody stubborn and come to bed already. Oh. Wow. You would rather sleep on the floor than share a bed with me. Well, thank you for the information. Nice to know you hold me in such high regard. Oh, well, that's not it. What, me? Why should I have any problems with sharing a bed with you? Yeah, I know you're a guy. I'm a big girl. I already know about the flowers and the bees already. Yeah, I really am okay with it. I suggested it after all. Now get in here or, um, I will unplug your phone charger. Oh, I certainly would. You know me. I can be cruel if I need to be. Ha! Finally. You're that scared of having to spend a day with an uncharged phone, huh? Hey, what are you doing? Boy, if you keep balancing on the outmost edge of the bed like that, you're gonna fall off in the middle of the night. And I will laugh if I wake up. Come a bit closer. Are you that afraid that I'm going to bite you or something? So what if we touch during the night? It's not like you're going to spontaneously burst into flames if you casually brush against my arm or something. Here. See? I touched you and nothing bad happened. See? Again. Hey, relax. Dude. Don't forget to breathe. I just touched your chest. It's fine. You will survive this. Stop making such a fuss already. We need to wake up early tomorrow. You really should try to get some shut eye. Oh, see. There you go. Do you have enough of the blanket? 
I don't want to be the one to hog too much. That's such a stupid cliche. A girl stealing her man's blanket. You're good? Hey then. Good night. Hey! Hold still! Stop struggling so much! Yeah? I'm hugging you? I need to snuggle something when I go to sleep. Back at home, I have a side sleeping pillow. But you're the only thing here, so you'll have to do. You stop pulling away and making this so difficult. You're gonna fall out of bed. Mm -hmm. Hey. Could you, like, maybe raise your upper body a minute so I can get my other arm underneath you? I want to wrap both my arms around you. Just feels weird when I can hug you with one arm only and have to keep the other one sort of awkwardly folded like this. Plus, I have to hold you or you'll probably just pull away again and fall off the bed for real. <gasps> Seriously, dude, why are you making such a fuss about this anyways? It's just some cuddling. That's all. I do this with my girlfriends all the time. They're being way too uptight about this stuff. Hey, but you're okay when I hug you during the day. Okay, so it makes you a little bit flustered. But you don't hate it. I can clearly see that you like it. Or... Don't you? See? How is this any different? Hugging during the day, completely fine. Hugging at night, end of the world. At this rate, I'd rather sleep on the floor. What kind of bullcrap logic is this? Now stop making such a fuss already. I'm trying to catch some sleep here. Mm. Mm. Hey. Are you still awake? Sorry, but could you, like, perchance turn around? Your back isn't snuggly enough. No offense. Okay, but would it be alright if I just nuzzle my head into your chest? Thank you. This is so much better. You're even cozier than my side sleeping pillow. We should do this way more often, really. Hmm? Well, I'm just playing with your hair. Now that I have my hands behind your back, I thought I might as well. Do you like it? Because, you know, you could play with my hair too, if you wanted. I would actually greatly appreciate that, really. It would probably help me fall asleep. And you look kind of tense, holding your arms at your side like that. Really, it's okay. You can touch me. I'm touching you as well, after all. What do you mean, what I'm doing? You make it sound like I'm hurting you or something. I'm trying to make you feel good, silly. I even booked a single bedroom to trick you into snuggling with me. Huh? Why? Well, first, I can't sleep without something to snuggle, and second, because I have a massive crush on you. Yeah, I have a crush on you. Ever since, like, we went to college, really. 
Oh, come on. I'm tired. Can't we talk about this tomorrow? We've got to give our presentation. Can't we just talk about this tomorrow after the conference? For real now. We have to get up early tomorrow. So we really should try and catch some sleep. Good night, honey. Yeah? What of it? I kissed you? Yes? I thought... I already told you I have a cross on you anyway, so... I might as well, right? Didn't you like it? Because I can see the blush on your face. Yes, you are. And it's super cute. Yes, I know it's dark, but I don't need to see you. I can hear it in your voice. You remember? Come on now, honey. Close those gorgeous eyes of yours. And hug me a bit more tightly. I want all of your snuggles. We're going to make a splash tomorrow at the conference. And then we can talk about this in quiet. But for now, let's go to sleep. <laughs>